Making our roads a safer place should be a priority for every driver. Another fatal accident has caused members of the community to start a petition to install flashing stop signs at the intersection of LA 397 and Goche Road. KPLC's Crimson Jeffers has the story. A two-way stop at an intersection of Goche Road and Louisiana Highway 397 claimed the life of 16-year-old Philip Connor earlier this week. A petition was started soon after by Zachary Broussard trying to bring attention to how dark the area gets at night and to possibly get flashing stop signs to the intersection. That intersection and like all the intersections down there, they've always been like since Laura, it's just pitch black every time you drive down there and I just thought like his death could have been avoided if there was just a small cheap change that they can make that like it would save other people. So far the petition has over 4,500 signatures agreeing with Bruce Ard that changes need to be made at the intersection. I was just trying to raise awareness for it and I mean I figured like I was emailing like the mayor and the traffic engineer and I figured if I had more signatures and more like proof that people were supporting the issue that maybe they'd be more likely to listen to it. I don't know. Bonnie Thompson lives close to where the accident took place. It's very dark out here and and even though you you travel the roads sometimes you forget due to the fact you got a traffic light four-way stop and you come here and it's a two-way. The family of Philip Connor knows the petition exists but they hope that the people who knew Philip will remember him for his life and love for others, not how he left this world. Crimson Jeffers, 7 News. If any changes are made at this intersection, it would be a combined effort of parish and state officials, according to the Department of Transportation.